guys, what's up and welcome back. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a review and lip swatch video on the new Marc Jacobs Lamarck Liquid Lipsticks. So there are six shades in the line, which I do have all six here to show you guys. Each specific one, so each individual one retails for $28 on Sephora's website. I will leave a link down below. And these are part of Marc Jacobs regular line. So you can pick it up anytime, it's not a limited edition. This is how the packaging looks on all of them. It's just really nice black and white. And then once you actually pop out the lip product, this is how it looks. Just like that, very Marc Jacob style, very classic. I really love these liquid lipsticks because, the packaging especially, because there's a little window down there and it just indicates what color the actual lip product is. So if you have like three or four of these, you don't have to actually open them up. You could just look at this little baby window here and see what color it is and then choose the one you personally want. Once you actually open this up, the packaging is really, really nice, very sleek, very high quality, which I would expect from Marc Jacobs. Um, once you actually take off the cover, the lid, this is how the doe foot applicator looks. It's just a regular doe foot applicator, but really, really nice and comfortable. Like it latches on the lips nicely and it's very, very easy to coat. So let's start off with the actual formula. The formula of these Marc Jacobs Lamarck Lip Creme Liquid Lipsticks are satin finishes, which I thought was so interesting just because when you think of a liquid lipstick, right away what comes to mind is a matte liquid lipstick or now it's starting to be like metallic with liquid lipstick so i did like the fact that mark jacobs took a little spin on it and did make his la creme liquid lipsticks a satin finish the next thing i wanted to touch up on is that i love the fact that there are only six shades included in the line just because sometimes with different lip like releases there's like either a hundred shades released to a line or like 12 or 15 or 30 or 40 shades released to a line and sometimes it could feel like I don't know, overwhelming, like do I get all of them? Should I get one of them? Do I like the formula? Would this look good with my skin tone? Do I wear this at a party? Do I wear this at this event? Like what do I do? So I really like the fact that there are six shades included in the line because it's very a very minimal amount, but the colors that you would wear on a daily basis, which brings me to my next topic, which is the color selection. The color selection in these lip products are basic, like colors you would wear on a daily basis. You can wear them for nice events, for every single day, work appropriate, or it's school appropriate as well. And I love that just because it's typically the colors that people generally wear often, you know? So you'll get basically your nudes, berry shades, pinky, mauve shades, and just everyday kind of colors. Now in regards to the formula, I'm like, oh my God. What? Marc Jacobs blew it out of the park with this and I love these. They feel so damn good on the lips. They feel so luxurious, so creamy, so rich, so beautiful. And you just like want it on there, you know? You know sometimes when you wear a lip product, you're like, get this thing off my lips now. This is so like deliciously feeling, you know? It's also formulated with like a special kind of butter and just different good like ingredients to actually hydrate the lips and make it feel really, really nice. And it really, really does do that. The application process of these are very, very simple. You don't have to actually go over your lips like three, four times. Literally one swipe will coat your whole bottom lip and then one swipe on top will coat your whole top lip and you're done. These do last also a really, really long time. Marc Jacobs does say last for about eight hours. I would probably have to agree with that and, and then after like about maybe I would say seven hours it starts kind of like diminishing and fading away but in a very very nice like subtle way and not obvious like not patchy not like gross not like whoa look at her lips just beautifully um, you could wear these with a lip liner I did find that with a lip liner they do stay much more well intact but even without a lip liner it's still beautiful on and it doesn't like bleed out of your lips pretty much wherever you put it that's where it stays I also really really love these besides for them being like comfortable as hell could ever be they don't emphasize anything like if anything they make your lips look more bigger powdery or just like really like nice looking it just basically makes your lips look like a million dollars i mean do these not look like a million dollars right now i think so and i really love these i really really do and even if each one does retail for 28 dollars which is like well so expensive it's the kind of lip product that you're going to just keep on using time and time again because the quality is there you know um, you can always go to Sephora and test them out and see how they perform, but I'm pretty sure you guys are not going to be disappointed because they are so, so, oh my god, nice. They also have a really nice vanilla scent. Whoa. Um, but it's not overpowering and you don't smell it when it's on your lips. I just absolutely love these and I think these are the best lip products I swear I've ever tried in my life. Whoa. 
That is a statement, but I really, really feel like it's true. So I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you guys have any questions or comments down below. If I miss out on anything, you can let me know as well. And if you guys try them out, let me know because I'm sure you guys will love them and report back like, yes, these are amazing. So I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. So let's start off with the pack. I'm alone.